boy Red King and I feel so happy to be back to YouTube recording and feels good to be back. So we're starting off with Airport CEO because that is my next video. And I have decided to add a new game Thursday. So if you guys want to go see what it is, head over to my Discord under it. Important. There's a tab called Uploading Schedule. Click that and you'll see what I have added for Thursday. If you are not in my Discord server, please join in the link below. Thank you very much. So, last time I recorded a play of this, it was a Beta 8. Well, now, Airport CEO is now a full release version. Normal bears, normal alphas, full release, along with uh, Supersonic DLC. So uh, I went ahead, got to this, and it has these two planes right here. So I'm very excited to hopefully fly them to my airport. So yes, a lot of changes have happened since we last played this. And since you guys last heard from me, so what we're gonna do is load up our YouTube. While that's loading, I'm going to talk to you guys about what's been happening. So, I've been working quite a lot, so I've been having quite a hard time recording, editing, and uploading. So, I have a question for everyone in the comments down below or Discord. If you would like to be my editor for my channel that edits all the videos for me, that I will I will hugely appreciate it. So if you want to edit for me with no cost, I'm gonna this is gonna be no costing, I ain't gonna pay anybody. This is gonna be completely free. Uh, please leave your name, information of how I can contact you to talk more about it, either Discord PMs or the description or in the comment section below. And the reason I'm looking for editors is because I'm working full time now, so I have hardly I have barely enough time to record, but I have hardly any time to edit. And would like somebody to edit the videos for me. So again, if you would like to be my editor at no cost at all, then either leave me your name and information in the comment section below, or a Discord and PMs. That's all pretty much I have to ask to say. So now I'm going to turn our attention back into Airport CEO. <laughs> After the fish loading, loading structures. Come on. There we go. So, this is where we left off last time when we played Airport CEO. So, I don't know if you guys remember what my vision was, but my visions have a big tunnel going down this way and one going up here. The highways are going to be at the bottom, on the bottom and on the top too. And in the middle will be a huge runway, probably a couple more on the sides. But yes. But what we're doing right now, just starting the uh, start the commercial terminal so what we gotta do is finish putting it together open the heat map panel yes this is a new thing that they added is a heat map panel this will show you where passengers and employees can walk and can't walk Green means they can walk in that area, red means they can't walk in it. So, this. Yes. 
So red means they can't walk in that area. Green means they can. So I actually like that. There is also this. Let's square turn off. They also have a new one called Display Passenger Types. So passengers that are in blue will be arrivals and the ones in purple will be the people that are leaving the airport to go somewhere else. They also add a couple of new links too, which we will get to that as the time let me turn off. We we will get to that when it comes to it. So now we have to decorate our terminal. Yeah, they changed the tutorials a bit now, so now they show you exactly you gotta go in your hotbar as to do that tutorial. So decorate. I'm guessing oh yes, I need plants. Well a nice big boy right there. Yes, I did enable construction, I think. Do I have any workers here? I should have workers. Let's see. Um, I have all of them deployed. So, oh, here he comes. Uh, says I got put some new floors, alright. We'll put some new floors. See if this would change his mind. There we go. <laughs> so now it says to place at least two small checkered desks. I like to place one small checkered desk for every stand we have. So six, we have six stands here. That means I'm going to be placing six checkered desks. And the carpets that I place down, as you guys can see, will help me separate the secure area from the not secure area. Because the blue will be the check-in area pretty much. Slash baggage bay area. And the red is security area. Area. Ugh. Area. Sorry guys. My speech can me a bit messed up. So we're gonna place an information desk actually. We're gonna place one right there actually. I know. We're actually gonna place one right here with a boy desk right there. So a small check in. I'll place six, three, four, five, whoopsies, five, six. And I also like to add a plant dip between just to bright up the terminal. There we go. Ah, right, yeah, I'll be back just for one sec. Uh, YouTube, we are back. So now I'm going to do the secured area, which I am not done at all actually. So let's quickly mark this area as secure. We'll do the same on the other side. Alrighty. 
So now I'm going to place in the small secure ports. Eventually this is going to be probably change up to medium and that's it. I really ain't going to put the large ones in. The large ones are paying for the medium and large flights, but for the small flights, I will just do the medium secure checkpoints. But till then, I'm going to have to place these. And I'm going to have these so much cool. There we go. Now we need to secure eggs on both sides. There we go. And to fill the gaps, we're going to put a wall too. Just to separate the secure zone from the not secure zone. Uh, G flight. We don't have a hanger, so. Oh, we do have a hanger. Oh, sweet, okay. Uh, let me get one of these placed out somewhere. Alright, that's gonna be for GA. Ah, huh, I thought I didn't have a research. Well, we're gonna quickly place it down then. There we go. Yes, a new thing that they add is that the taxiways can be diagonal, which I love. So that's another new thing that they added, which I'm grateful. So now it says place a body desk near each stand, adjustment to the terminal building, and wait for them to be built. Alright, so the boarding part, I like to have them, I like, like that, like, pretty much like that, because the arrow will be facing this part right here, so I like to do that. And we will place the seats. Alrighty, and one more. I think I already named these. Did I name these? Yes, I did. So I did name those. Actually, let's go ahead and put the season now before I forget. And we all got copy and paste this. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? We'll put it right there. <laughs> Alright, so let's copy this. I gotta also watch my money too. There put one right there. I'm gonna flip a dewey, we'll put two right there, like that. Okay, this side is a bit more shorter. Thought I made it even, I guess I did it. But those can now be built. Alrighty. I think once these are built, we can get the employees. J except what well, I, I connected that. There we go. So this would be joination only. So now I can All right, fast forward. Okay, this is an aircraft. And we do get pay every we get pay hourly to fix the aircraft. So small ones would pay us hundred fifty, which. 
just getting my opinion. Alright, so now let's connect these. So we can handle up to six GAs. And I'll show you guys my plan of action where I want the medium aircrafts. The medium stands to me. Also known as Terminal 2. Because this is going to be known as Terminal 1. Just for small. That's it. But the plan for medium is to have it. I think on the right side over here. Because normally when I am playing for CEO, without recording, I always have it on this side. So I think I'll change it up and have it over here on the right side. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, what you, Oh, the runway. Yeah, it needs to be repaired. There we go. Runway prepared. Alright, so open your runway for commercial use. Yes, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, I did name these. Yes, I did change mode. Uh, we need to actually research night flights. While this is researching night flights, we can... Night flights, there we go. We can hire the employees, so we need uh, six, we need a total of 12 passenger service uh, people, so we have a staff, okay, uh, so we're going to applicants, go to passenger service agents, and we need 12. Yes, they actually increase the applicants now. So usually you can have up to five, that's it. But they increase it to eight, which I'm very happy. So we're gonna hire pretty much all these guys except that person. Uh how many do I have now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That can be right. There we go. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I have nine and I need twelve. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. There we go. So now we need whip agents. Uh, I think two. I think there's a. I think a small thing has. Two, I think. So we'll just add twelve too. One, two, three, four, five. Reject all of them. Six. Seven. Eight. Oops, nine. Didn't mean to hide that person, but okay. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. We'll get fifteen. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. All right. So this our way up agents. We'll quickly get them leveled up. Only we'll level them up to the green. All right. So security officers. We got how many of those we got? So we got. So we need six. So one, two, three, four. Five. Come on, one more. We'll have ten. Six. Seven. 
seven. Eight, nine. God, one more good one. Oh, come on. There we go. So now we get a couple of service technicians, just a couple. Janus, we also get a couple of them. Exclusive, so we need CIO, SCOO, to do the auto flights. That they may should be good. Alright, we're going to disable that for passengers and all the employees. Sorry, the employees can't go through there. Uh, but just to be on the safe side, I'm going to also have them come through here too. We'll do a nice, large, simple door. That just makes sure no way goes in it. We're going to stuff it up. There we go. There we go. So just in case they can't get through the secu security checkpoint for some reason, they can go through that way. So now we need to enable uh, operations enable that. Now we get to get to flight contracts. So I do have mods in here of real life aircrafts and real life airlines too. So I also I think putting this uh, real life aviation fuel companies and construction companies too, I think. I'm not sure. But we're going to filter this, do airlines. And we're going to do Anchorland, uh, Shrava Regional, Stripe Air Regional, and we'll do what a new base game airlines that they made, which was Edwards Bay. There we go. Oh, I forgot these people don't have seats. Let's quickly add some seats so that they can sit while they're waiting for their flights. Alright, so that's done. As for that, our first flight is actually due at uh, 12.35 with 11 people. So I think after we see the flight come in, we are going to go ahead. Object is not functional. Why is that? Um. So what's that airline gets landed in here? We're going to get a video when it comes in. So. Yeah, once again, I'm looking for an editor that, is, that I'm going to be paying at no cost for, no fees or anything. Just a completely editor that I would like free that won't ask for any money for me. It would just instead add videos for me because I would really appreciate it. So if you want to be my editor, Please let me know in the comments with your name and how I can get a hold of you. Either email or phone number. Probably prefer email. And then you can either do the same in Discord too by DMing me your name and how I can contact you too if you want to be my editor. That's all I pretty much have to say. But here it is. Let's slow it down. 
So I want to thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow for, I think, Minecraft. I'll have to check. But yeah, other than that, enjoy the video and have a great day. Bye.